In this video, we will show you, the top 7 best things to see in Paris. Starting at number 7, is, Mont Saint-Michel. Mont Saint-Michel is located on an island which was originally called Mont Tombé, but became known as Mont Saint-Michel in the 8th century, when Street Aubert, Bishop of Avranche, built an oratory there after having a vision of the Archangel Saint Michael. It rapidly became a pilgrimage center, and in 966 a Benedictine Abbey was built there. Mont Saint-Michel is located on a tidal island and mainland commune in Normandy, France. The island lies approximately one kilometer off the country's northwestern coast, at the mouth of the Quinone River near Avranche and is 7 hectares in area. Admission starts at around 11 euros. Mont Saint-Michel is located at, 5, 0, 1, 7, 0, Mont Saint-Michel, France. Restaurants close to the Mont Saint-Michel, Restaurant La Prix Sale, Le Chapeau Rouge, La Serene Loquette. Number 6, Montmartre Hill. The name Montmartre is usually understood to mean the Martyr's Hill. It was in Montmartre that Denis, Bishop of Paris was martyred by the Romans. He became Saint Denis. Montmartre was also associated with temples to the Roman gods Mars and Mercury. Montmartre is home to one of the last working vineyards in Paris. Also the Sacré Cour is built from a limestone which bleaches itself. Admission starts at around 17 euros. Montmartre Hill is located, it sits atop a hill in the north of the city in the 18th arrondissement. Restaurants close to the Montmartre Hill, Sacré Serre Crepe Café, Le La Marque and Le Cabanon de la Butte. Number 5, Versailles. The Palace of Versailles, known as Chateau de Versailles, has been listed as a World Heritage Site for 40 years and is one of the greatest achievements in French 17th century art. Louis XIII's old hunting pavilion was transformed and extended by his son, Louis XIV, when he installed the court and government there in 1682. It was initially built as a small hunting lodge but has had considerable expansion since that time. King Louis XIV was in charge of the construction of the Palace of Versailles, whose motivation was to outdo the Vaux le Vicomte, which was built for Nicolas Fouquet, interim ruler of France at the time. Versailles was then established as the symbol of aristocracy in France. Versailles really went all out on the luxury in the palace, even the chamber pots were made from silver. Both Peace of Paris treaties were signed at Versailles. The gardens of Versailles covered more than 30,000 acres, homing 400 sculptures and 1,400 fountains. Admissions to the Chateau de Versailles is sometimes free. The Palace of Versailles is located at, Place d'Arme, 78,000 Versailles, France. Restaurants close to the Palace of Versailles are, or du Casso Chateau de Versailles, La Table du 11 and Brasserie de la Durandole. Number 4, Saint-Chapelle. The Saint-Chapelle, Holy Chapel, was commissioned by King Louis IX, Saint-Louis, possibly from architect Pierre of Montreuil between 1242 and 1248 in the Palais de la Cité, then the royal residence. Consecrated in 1248, the sacred shrine was designed to house the relics of the Passion of Christ. Saint-Chapelle was built to house his collection of religious relics, the Saint-Chapelle is visited for the beauty of its stained glass windows, among the most sumptuous in the world. Louis IX decides to place these precious items in a more prestigious location than the little Saint-Nicolas chapel. Thus, the king calls for the construction of a new chapel within the old Palais Royal de Lille de la Cité, specially designed to house these sacred items. Admissions to the Saint-Chapelle starts at around 10 euros. The Saint-Chapelle is located at, 10 BD du Palais, 75001 Paris, France. Number 3, Arc de Triomphe. The Arc de Triomphe Paris is 162 feet tall and 150 feet wide. The Arc de Triomphe was modeled after the Roman Arch of Titus. It was commissioned by Napoleon I to commemorate the victory of France in the Battle of Austerlitz, with the names of all French victories and generals inscribed on its inner and outer surfaces. Under its vault lies the tomb of the unknown soldier from the First World War. Admissions to the Arc de Triomphe starts at around 13 euros. The Arc de Triomphe is located at, P.L. Charles de Gaulle, 75008 Paris, France. Restaurant close to the Arc de Triomphe are, Victoria Paris, Restaurant Oxt, 
and Restaurant La Drugstore. Number 2, The Eiffel Tower. The Eiffel Tower, or as the French call it, La Tour Eiffel, is one of the world's most recognizable landmarks. The tower was designed as the centerpiece of the 1889 World's Fair in Paris and was meant to commemorate the centennial of the French Revolution and show off France's modern mechanical prowess on a world stage. The tower was built by Gustave Eiffel's civil engineering firm in two years, two months, and five days, using 7,500 tons of iron and 2.5 million rivets. When Gustave Eiffel designed his namesake tower, he cleverly included a private apartment for himself where he hosted famous guests, like Thomas Edison. The apartment is now open for the public to tour. Entrance to the Eiffel Tower starts at approximately 10 euros to 20 euros. You can skip the line using some of the tour services for a few dollars more. The Eiffel Tower is located at, Cham de Mars, 5 of. Anatole France, 75,007 Paris, France. Restaurant close to the Eiffel Tower are, Macaroon Bar, La Belle Parisienne and Jules Verne. At the number one must-visit location in Paris is, the Louvre Museum. The Louvre filled with rich culture, history and heritage was the residence of former kings of France two centuries ago and is regarded as the world's greatest museum. The Louvre displays a collection of 35,000 art pieces spread over 60,000 square meters, divided into eight departments. Masterpieces displayed are Mona Lisa, La Venus de Milo, Laredo de la Meduse, La Liberté Guidant La Pupla among others. Admission ranges from 0 euros to 17 euros. The Louvre Museum located at, Rue de Rivoli, 75001 Paris, France, is an extraordinary place that must be visited during a stay in Paris. Good food can be consumed from, Bistro Benoit, Brasserie du Louvre, Baus and Le Fumoir. Book your travel today. You will not be disappointed.